Hey everyone, welcome back to Rust Promoter, and today we are uh, doing something a little different. I'm going to kind of experiment with uh, the types of videos that I do, and wanted to do one to get into the festive uh, spirit. I know that uh, Christmas is just around the corner, um, so I wanted to play one of my favorite Christmas levels. Um, this is off of Gex 3, the deep cover Gecko. If you've never played Gex, uh, it is a older PlayStation era game uh, that had one for the 64 um, in Game Boy Color. Um, but it was a platforming series that uh, kind of focused on more uh, pop culture references and uh, more tuned towards teenagers. So uh, there, you'll see a lot of that kind of humor in this. But it's still a really enjoyable game. Um, so I'm excited to show you guys this, so let's get started. So, this game is super colorful, for sure. And that's how the mayor got his pants back. What's this? Ladies and gentlemen, I've just been handed some late-breaking news. Special Agent Extra, head of the TV Terrorist Defense Unit, and star of many of my private dreams, is apparently missing. Judge Jerry Springer! Agent Extra was last seen wearing 8-inch pumps and a red bathing suit. Her current whereabouts are unknown. Gex. Gex. Agent Extra? You poor kidnapped mix. Hey, Tiger. Guess where I am? Trapped in the media dimension. Rez is back, and he's kidnapped me to get to you. He's attacking your secret island cave. Hey, speaking of secrets, you want to see my... Guess. Like I said, Quit clowning lots around. of get uh, me teen here. humor. <laughs> uh, so that is Marlise you are now being so uh, Andriata. I'm probably saying that name Guess. terribly wrong, but uh, she's also... Uh, she's an uh, actress off of uh, Baywatch and a Playboy model. Uh, yeah, so were they were definitely trying to aim towards a particular group of people in this my way. Uh, series. Hey, that tingles. Let's get ready for the ultimate gecko yeah, weapon, so, baby. Uh, obviously, yeah. Austin Powers was uh, pretty popular at this time, so there are t tons of references uh, to uh, Austin Powers in this. Um, some of the pop culture references are hit, some are miss, but. Um, overall, I enjoy it. I think there's some some fun fun moments in this game. Uh, all the levels are themed after um, TV and uh, movie references, and, and uh, so we're going to start out. The first level, luckily, is the holiday level, exactly what we want. Sweet, bear minty, they mumble. So the pole. Okay. Nice and cozy with the little snowman. So the Let remote controls act on. like keys, um, and then in order to get more remote controls, I have to take on these missions, just like uh, Mario the 64, where you. you um, have to choose, you know, what what you want to do in the levels. Uh, I'm not going to go straight to try to take down Evil Santa. We have to go through his else first, uh, so we'll go ahead and knock that off. You can't just get to Santa and take out his little minions. Cold blood. Bad combination. So, Gex, uh, every level that he gets in, he has a different outfit, which I think is pretty fun. Um, and you can also unlock them, I do believe, to use them in whatever level you want. Little flies are um, the equivalent of coins in this, so... Um, Collecting those will give you life up. 
My name is Daryl, this is my other brother Daryl. Auditions for the shining right this way. Oh. I know I lick it, but my tongue oh. gets stuck. <laughs> Goofy sound freaking elves make. That's your sidekick. Seems like a good idea to me, sir. So he's trying to be a reference to Alfred and uh, Batman. He's like the, of like the sidekick, the butler, I should say. As I said, some uh, teen humor with the uh, Santa bites. So a lot of this stuff is just Nap time. tons of little um, little hidden things to try to get the dragonflies. I keep calling them dragonflies, but I'm pretty sure they're just flies. Now these aren't the um, the elves I'm supposed to get. There's snowboarding elves, which I think are up there. Now, if I go up here, Santa, as this so eloquently tells me, uh, is up at the very top. So we're going to skip by that right now. We're just going to continue exploring the level. Mm. Yes, this, uh, this level I played a lot. I usually try to play it, you know, every other Christmas or so. Um, fills me with lots of nostalgia, so. Just overall charming. Um, the song, especially. <laughs> oh, how do I? Oh, there you go. It's up here. Alright, so I'm gonna get up to the top here and try to hop down. I do believe I can hop down this chimney. It's been a while, I can't remember. Oh. <laughs> Penguin's making the chicken sounds. Oh. My favorite holiday! So that's my energy if I get hit once, uh, I'll lose a paw print, and, um, okay, that's where I need to go. Dunce and candy cake. Oh! How fruity. Okay. Try that again. Donner party for 20. Donner party for 20. Colder than Ava Gabor's wig fridge. <laughs> so, of course, being a pop culture, um, the references are kind of old. So, there's a lot of these I don't even um, know, or I wasn't. I mean, this game came out in the 90, 99, I think. I was only like nine years old, so I don't. Some of them are beyond me. I'm gonna give this one more try. If I can't get inside, we're gonna move on. Pretty sure. So this TV over here, um, once I complete whatever objective, uh, I come, it'll pop up the remote control on that, and I just jump on that, and I will complete the level. Okay. All right. Well, we're just gonna completely skip that and go to the scenic area. No, this is um. That's an extra life. Okay. Okay, so these um, are one of the ice sculptures. This is part of the other objective that I'm not going to do right now. Uh, but what, what does make cool, it doesn't matter what you select in the beginning. Uh, you can go back and, and 
just if you just decide to change your mind, like I could go right now and just go and start taking out all the ice sculptures if I wanted to, but I'm going to go back to actually I know there's a hidden something further here. Oh jeez. I am so rusty at this. Alright, so there he is. Okay, so that's Rex. Um, he's a uh, one of your buds. Uh, you can actually doing this will unlock a secret level for him later on. So I'm just gonna do that because it's fun. I don't want him to be freezing to death in there. So what you have to do is you have to push him close to the fire in place. And boom! boom. Okay. So the levels are decently large, nothing too crazy there, but nothing. things interesting. Mr. Wonka, Baruka stole a gobstopper. Okay, there we go. Those do actually like so many. My favorite holiday. Part where all the snowboarding elves are. I'm getting to another ice sculpture. Ah, this. So this is before people used the analog stick all the second analog stick all the time. And so, oh, so I have to use the R1 and L1 buttons to go to the camera, which is not ideal. There we go. <laughs> Things for the shining, right this way. Yeah. Makes sense. Okay, yeah, this is just one of those high sculptures, so I'm just gonna knock that out. I'm pretty sure each one of those, uh, you get a certain number, number in the level of those ball prints, those will be able to on the remote, so it's kind of a hidden objective. If I'm not mistaken. And so Holly and Jolly! The dancing candy canes. Okay, so that's... I don't want to do that. I don't want to complete the ice objective. It's longer than it needs to be. So I do the same thing with that ice block over there to get the secret coin um, that I did with Rex. Creepy beard. Elves. They're quite annoying. <laughs> Oh, maybe I lied. I can just get the secret point. Like the inside of Santa's head after an eggnog bender. All right, so now I got the snowboard. Warning, yellow patch. Warning. I have to take these dudes out. Oh. Hey, I'm snowboarding here. Oh my gosh, just hit him. Christmas town. I'm just Use the snow bridge really well. Hey, I can't 
that. Oh, missed it. Missed it. Oh. This place is colder than Ava Gabor's wig fridge. Oh, great, another snowboarding game. Okay. All right. Snowboarding uphill. It's that simple. Let's go snowboarding now. Everybody's learning how. I'm just a nerd traveling in the Oh my gosh, now. just give me the elf. Give me the elf! Ah! Oh, gosh. Check me out! I'm extreme! Alright, oh! Oh my gosh, I'm almost done. Let me get the freaking elf. Sorry if I'm making you sick. I'm making myself sick. Ugh! Give him to me! Oh my gosh. Alright. We got this. We got this. Oh, oh Harvey, I wanna be a yeah. Froggy! You better have Donner party for 20. Donner party for 20. Remember that time I told you I was gonna take down Santa? Oh, there we go. Okay. There's one more? Ah, uh, there's one more. There he is. Target. I'm hitting too many. Too soon. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, I gotcha. Give me a good old three swap. You are the last. It's like the inside of Santa's hands after an egg of the bender. Place is colder than Ava Gabor's wig fridge. Oh my gosh. I don't remember it being this difficult. Maybe I was better when I was a kid. Yeah! Oh, come on, I hit you twice! There you go. Alright, finally. So if you haven't ran to the bathroom yet, um, let's finish this and then we'll take down Santa. Luckily, I know exactly. Lock and load, little lizard. That shows break down what I did this round. Nice work, Frosty. You're getting warmer. Not warm enough. When this is over, I say we perform a few experiments with body heat. Good technique. That hat does nothing for me. Now how about you focus that extreme sports tale of yours on getting me out of here? You know, my younger teenage self was all for this game, and I don't know why. I can't can't put a finger on it. Um, let's go back in there and quickly take down it's the head honcho time. of the holidays, old evil Santa. So he's kind of like the the boss of this level, if you will. And we're gonna cut to the chase too. It's just Slow down there. You better run. We're playing for Keith Novo. Hey, Cowboy, you better run. Uh. Somebody tell Jackie Brown I found her hat. You better run. Luckily, I'm wearing the sun. You better run. Uh, run. 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 Alright. Alright, so there he is. Um, look at him. He's pretty scary looking. He's got like a dark face and red eyes. That's how every kid views Santa when you were little. When you start screaming. Ah, crap. So, the goal is I gotta tail whack his. There it is. Always remember that line. You're on the worst. I think the classic three times will do it. And take that, Santa. All right, so that's we know where that's at before. Saw that through last time. 
Luckily, no fall damage. <laughs> Is it Santa's? My shop? favorite holiday, <laughs> Halloween. There's some good jokes in there. Some hit and misses, but. Yeah, so this is the last of the Luke X games. This game, um, after that, uh, Crystal Dynamics, the company that made it, decided to give it up. I think the, I think this has kind of played it out. I mean, overall, I enjoy X, and I think it would be great to see a new one nowadays. I don't know. I mean, all the pop culture references they could do nowadays would be great. So. And here we go. Lock and load, little lizard. So that was it. Um, I won't go back through anymore. I want to just, just kind of get to Santa and show you a little extra of the levels there. But highly recommend Gex 3, honestly. It's a cheap game. Uh, you can enjoy it um, on the 64 or the PlayStation. They even have a Game Boy Color version, which I don't really know how good that is. As obviously, it's going to be drastically different than this version. But... Um, highly recommended. I hope you all have a great holiday season. Uh, thank you for watching. I will be posting more videos here soon.